I'm Dr. Andrew Moore. I'm the director of the Great Books Program at St. Thomas University. So I get to teach things like Shakespeare, Homer, Virginia Woolf, all my favorite stuff. Hello, my name is Gül Çalışkan. I am one of the sociology professors at St. Thomas. I teach globalization and gender, introduction to sociology, qualitative research methods, contemporary uh, theory, and uh, research for social change. My name is Kim Fenwick and I'm the Vice President Academic and Research here at St. Thomas University. My name is Philip Lee. I teach journalism and communications. One of the things I've always thought is really special about St. Thomas is that we are exclusively about the liberal arts and that makes us really unique in all of Canada. Uh, and one of the things I've always liked about that is that no matter what you're studying here at STU, it kind of feels like everybody here is participating in the same big conversation. So I think even though we're apart this year, uh, we're still all involved in that same shared enterprise. When it comes to value of liberal arts education, I am very biased. I think it is the most important skill any individual can have because liberal arts offer us very important few skills. One of them is thinking critically, the second one is reading broadly and writing clearly. So these three skills can be transferred or transcended to many different areas, so it's very important. We always see connections between what we're reading and learning with what is happening in, in the world around us. And the, the education that, that we offer at St. Thomas, I think helps, opens doors of understanding to the world that you wouldn't otherwise have. And I think that big events like pandemics change the course of history. And it's, I think it's more important now than ever that we have young people who are going to lead us into times of change, that they have a deep understanding of history, of art, of literature, and that they will be able to guide us as we go forward in a meaningful way. This uh, pandemic experience, although everything is disrupted, still we are going through that understanding and reflection. That space of necessity of understanding and reflecting is the space for liberal arts. Liberal arts tools gives us all the necessity, the needs we have when we navigate these interruptions. I invite liberal arts students to really pause and really appreciate this experience. Don't see it as a downfall, don't let it slip through your hands, but really embrace this historic moment. The liberal arts are about the why questions. They're about priorities, the fundamentals. Um, what is a human life about? Uh, what do we prioritize in our communities? And those are questions we're asking urgently right now, right? What matters? What matters most? Um, what ought we to sacrifice in order to achieve other things? Um, and those are the things we talk about in the liberal arts. One of my favorite quotes, um, which is from one of our own students who was valedictorian, she said in her valedictory that people ask her, what can you do with a liberal arts degree? And her answer is, what can't you do? And I thought that was the perfect answer because really you can take this degree anywhere. And I have seen many of our students come here with no idea what they want to do. And that puts a lot of pressure and stress on students thinking they need to know what they want to do when they start university. You don't need to know what you want to do when you start a liberal arts degree because you'll discover that as you explore your degree. I think that the, the most important thing I learned as an undergraduate when I went to university was to uh, to show up and be there and do my work and not fall behind. And I think that's really all we expect of students is to, to be there, to, be, to get engaged and, uh, and to, to do the work that's, that's in front of them. And I think it sounds kind of simple, but if, if students do that, they're generally successful. My advice to students would be about communication. I think it's gonna be really important to reach out to your professors. Uh, we want to hear from you, so if you have a question or a problem or you're really excited about the course, I think reach out to us, send us an email, uh, let us know these things. I think it's going to be really important to stay in touch. And that goes with your classmates too, like talk to your classmates online, get to know them. Um, that's a really important part of the university experience. I think if you're the kind of person who values democracy or freedom or human rights, 
It's really important you understand that we don't just get those things automatically. We need to establish those things and we need to preserve them and we need to defend them. So we need people who understand law and politics and history and culture and all those things we study at St. Thomas. We need people who can build the kind of society that will cherish those things that we value.